anything? Coffee? Uh, tea? No, I'm, I'm good. Just a few more pages. Almost there.
a Lithuanian fish man <laughs> who's going to make Mexican style soup. I know. <laughs> it's a big twist. <laughs> it's uh, super twisty. <laughs> what do you think is the best part? Oh, I'd say it's following the journey of this gentle, humble, Lithuanian fishman. <laughs> he comes to America knowing no one, and all he has is his can-do attitude from the old country and his great-grandmother's soap recipe. Can he make it happen? I, I'm really rooting for him. Okay, uh, I see. And um, <clears throat> what do you think it's about? Overcoming <laughs> obstacles, uh, achieving the dream, uh, no matter how unlikely the chances. <laughs> no, no, that's not it. It's about how you think you're doing one thing and then suddenly life smacks you with a curveball. You were making soap, and now you're making soap. It's a it's a lemon to lemonade story. Okay, um, I can see that. I was kind of close though. But it's a lot to put into a children's story. <laughs> I mean, the whole business angle. It might be hard for them to get. It's not. A children's story. How in the world did you think that? Well, he's got this enormous smelly dog that goes everywhere with him, and, and he talks to it, and he thinks the dog talks back to him. Uh, plus, he puts all the herbs in the pot, and they grow and grow. <laughs> Those are Lithuanian folk elements. <laughs> it's magical realism. Can't you understand that? How's that coffee coming? <laughs> Don't distract me. You're not telling me what you really think. I am. I said it, it's alive and creative and dramatic and it took a lot of work there. And? I don't know. Okay. Let me ask you some more specific questions. What about the part where he goes backwards in time <laughs> to ask his great-grandmother about that one ingredient in the soap recipe? Yeah, that was a little confusing. A, a creative for sure, but I thought he committed to the SOPA plan by then. And, and also the whole going back in time thing, I mean, I wasn't prepared for that. <laughs> The talking dog and all the herbs didn't prepare you for that. Not really. <laughs> what about where he marries the turtle? <laughs> yeah, um, that was. But at least she she's a reptile, so she can exist in water. I did buy that. So good work there. Yeah, you keep working on it, and I'm sure you'll. Really have something. <laughs> do you have more questions? I can tell. Oh, I do, but you'll clear them up in the next draft. <laughs> next draft? This is it. It is? <laughs> this is it? <laughs> Of course. Why would I show it to you before I perfected it? You said you wanted to learn from everything I have to say. I do. I knew there'd be small things I missed. Uh, Continuity-like problems. You know, like in movies. You know, the, the little things that someone else would see. You know, if you think you've perfected it and all you wanted was copy editing, why didn't you say so? I took notes. Lots and lots of notes. Okay, like what? Okay, um, oh, there, there's this. <clears throat> he felt like a fried fish on a spatula, golden crisp and ready to get to work. Mm -hmm. A fried fish ready to work? 
<laughs> and the problem is? <laughs> uh, how about this? Um, her eyes were as bright as a pair of new LED light bulbs. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, they were! And this! The fragrant soap ingredients blended together like the four-part harmony of a barbershop quartet. I mean, that is so mixed metaphor. Well, if you don't get it, you don't get it. Uh, and, and when he left Lithuania, he was just a man. And when he gets off the plane here, he's a fish man. I know people can do a lot in the restroom of a plane. <laughs> There's no transition, no preparation. How did it happen? I told you. It's magical realism. Ugh. <laughs> Ugh. Tara. Sit down with me. <clears throat> it, you've asked me what I think, and, and this is it. You are so talented. I mean, you write your own column for the newspaper. You've won awards. It, it's what you do best. But this isn't what you do best. It's not believable as a book for adults. I had to force myself to finish it. What if you rethought it as a children's book, a, a fantasy story with Fishman and his big dog <laughs> taking on the world of luxury soaps? <laughs> How about that? But the important thing is, is you love the process, no matter what the outcome is. That's what you really think. It is. Oh, I'm sorry. Wait. What are you doing? Are. No, 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 no. Don't do that because of what I said. What did I know? <laughs> You can fix it. I'm sure you can. No, it's 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 bad. I, I know it's bad. I thought you said it was perfect. It's perfectly bad. <laughs> what? This is the real one. <laughs> Why did you have me spend so much time on the other one? I wanted to know. You'll tell me what you really think. Oh, oh I was so worried <laughs> about what I was saying. I mean, it, it was hard to tell you those things. Are you sure you're, you're not mad or hurt? No. It's what I hoped you'd say. Because it is bad. <laughs> I tried hard to let your Lithuanian <laughs> finish me. <laughs> you don't have to like everything I write. But you want to believe me when I say I do. Right. <laughs> So, uh, no fish man this time, uh, no magical <laughs> realism. No. <laughs> now we you make some coffee. <laughs> sure.